Okay, so the first thing that we are going to do to white label our desktop app is you are going to want to decide on a URL, okay? So for me, it's app.sealdigital.com. I thought long and hard about that one. Just kidding. Uh, so you could do app.yourdomain.com or crm.yourdomain.com. You could even register a special domain name just for your CRM because it's yours, right? And the reason why we want to white label our CRM is because honestly, why not? You know, I mean, if, if you have a chance to say, you know, Hey, this is my CRM. I developed it for you, which is true because you wrote all the campaigns, you did all the triggers, you programmed it exactly how you wanted it to go. Right? So there's nothing wrong with it. Um, and I also know other, Marketers who have said, you know, I collaborated with a bunch of other marketers to have this software written. So it's just whatever spin you want to take on it, guys. It, it, it was designed for you to be able to white label it. So there's absolutely nothing wrong with doing that. Okay. Uh, and it's not hard. So with that being said, here we go. All right. So let's go with app.sealdigital.com or actually in my case, I'm going to do a new one and call it app.nerdlevel.io. All right. So you're going to want to go into your domain settings. So if you have GoDaddy or Ionos or I don't know, whatever uh, registrar that you have, you're going to want to go into the domain settings and you're going to want to go into the DNS right here. Okay. So make sure you go into the DNS settings because you're going to want to be looking at your records and it's going to look like this. All right. Now, you're going to want to add a record. This is so easy, guys. There's four steps. You're going to add a CNAME record. All right. And you're going to go app and then points to this is super important. Don't mess this up. App.messagesender.com. M-S-G-S-N-D-R. All right. No vowels because we're cool like that. And then click on save. Okay. Save. Now it's going to say like preview. If you have Ionos, it's going to say preview app on our level dial. Perfect. Perfect. That's exactly what we want. Click save. All right. Then go back in the high level and go to the very top agency settings. Now, if you don't see the screen, there's going to be like a little, two little arrows here that you're going to click. And then go to settings and you should see this agency settings click agency settings all right then go down and where it says white label domain type the link that you just created okay all right and then click update company now this is very important guys you are going to have to make sure that from now on, when you are logged into high level, you are logged into your white label domain. Okay. That means don't go to app.gohighlevel.com anymore. Okay. Don't do that because it's going to break a bunch of stuff and it's going to look weird and it's not going to work right. Okay. I promise I've done it before. All right. Also, you're going to want to make sure that you put your privacy policy URL here. Okay. So that's because on the login screen, it's going to link to your privacy policy. And if you don't put anything here, it's going to go to the high level website. All right. And then your logo, you can update your logo here. Okay. And mine is white because I've got a dark background. Um, and then I've got, you know, custom branding on mine. So that's why I have it like that. So that is how you white label your domain guys. Wasn't that easy. Now you are going to have to wait potentially 24 to 48 hours for DNS to propagate and propagate means just fully go through the internets. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, DNS, I'll help you out. I know, um, I know some uh, fairly impatient people. You know who you are. I love you anyway. But if you're one of those impatient people, 
you can go to whatsmydns.net and change it to CNAME and then type app.yourdomain.com. Click on search and look, it says whitelabel.gohighlevel.com. Okay. Which you want this green check mark. You want the green check mark. And then I'm going to do um, the one that I didn't create just so I could show you what it looks like if it's not done. That's what it looks like if it's not done. Okay. All right, guys. So that's it for now. Uh, make sure to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Oh, hey, wait. If you want to scale your marketing agency to the next level, you're not going to want to miss our marketing agency Facebook group. It's completely free and focused for agency owners. We do weekly live trainings with top industry experts, and we also do exclusive interviews for our members. You can join here using this bit.ly link, and it's gonna take you through our messenger bot that will send you straight to the Facebook group. And we also have a full suite of courses available for agency and high level training. So don't miss this guys, go to the link below and we'll get you taken care of. See you soon.